everyone, and welcome to Zutlow's Kitchen. So, Nina didn't get the memo today, and she started doing what I, what we were supposed to make already. So, this is what I'm going to show you. We're having pork chops, but we're having pork chops in the slow cooker. So let me show you what that looks like. That's how they look. Um, as you can see, they're slow cooking. They have about five hours left. Um, I don't know what she seasoned it with, but it looks like it smells like some barbecue se like seasoning, but I could be wrong. I'm sure she did some, you know, the normal garlic powder, onion powder, garlic, salt, all that stuff. Um, as for the others, I'm not sure. We'll have to ask her when she uh, comes back, but definitely onion powder and garlic powder um hmm maybe a little bit of paprika let's see let's see if we can discover what she seasoned it with hmm maybe maybe a little jack daniels oh yeah she definitely used some jack, jack daniels pork rub so we're going to let that cook for five hours, and then we will see what the final product is. So, stay tuned. I'm going to turn them over. Yep. You know, what I may do is... What would you do? Give it a few more, and then I think I'm going to drain all of this, yeah. this um, liquid out of here. Mm -hmm. And just leave a little bit in there. And then I may add some onion. Yes. And... You know, I have two potatoes. I may throw those in here, too. Oh, there you go. And see, we were right. It it was garlic powder, onion powder. Garlic salt. Garlic salt, onion salt. Yes, and Jack Daniels, um, Jack Daniels pork rub. So that's what's on here. Um, I'm also going to make, uh, I'm going to make slow cooker brown sugar garlic chicken one day so that's gonna be that's gonna be good and nina's putting the spices in the fridge which i don't know why they but, don't go in the fridge but yes when she chopped okay when, so what i've done is i drained some of the liquid there's a lot of liquid she drained so i'll just pour a little bit back in just so there's something in there then what i did is i had two giant potatoes so i cut those up i a few carrots just for flavor and I've got some I half an Vidalia onion and I cut up some garlic okay all I did was I threw some garlic salt not garlic salt um onion powder and garlic powder on there garlic powder like always yes and I'm just gonna throw these in here so it's almost like a like a stew almost pork chop stew yeah, except it's not going to be like a, it's not going to have enough liquid to be a stew. No. You know. But at the end, I'm going to throw some, I don't want to do it yet because I don't want it to, but I'm going to put, just throw some little pork gravy on there. Pork gravy. Yeah, let all this cook. Nice and delicious. Yep. It smells delicious. You could really smell sure that, uh, that uh, pork rub. Yes. That Jack Daniels. I, I... I recommend that you buy that. They have Jack Daniels chicken, pork, and steak. Yeah, and I think we have all three. We do. We do. In fact, I think we have two chicken ones. Oh. All right, so she's getting the last bit of the onion and the potato and the garlic. Okay, so that's all in there. Just going to smush it around. And put the cover back on. Oops. Forgot some onion. And according to this, it's got another three hours to cook. We will come back in another couple hours and see how it's going. All right. Thank you. We'll be back. There, looks good. It looks good. What were you? Ooh, look at that. All right, you know what we're doing. I put some pork gravy in there. Oh, oh yeah, you see it? And they are ready to go. Actually, one broke because they're so tender. Oh. Pork chop. Ooh. Little 
potato. So, got some potatoes and onions. <laughs> some carrots. Okay, so let's put all this in the dish. Ooh. You're, you're, you're hanging off there. Oh, that's just a piece of onion. All right, there we go. Believe me, you don't at, need a knife. Ooh, look at that. Here's a fork, take a test. All right. Let's try it. Is it center? <laughs> oh, look at that. Fell right off, look at that. Mmm, mmm, oh, oh, this is good. You taste that uh, garlic and onion powder. Good, I'm glad. And you taste that, uh, that pork rub, too. Jack, Jack Daniels, huh? No, look, it literally, look, get over here. Oh, my man. Falls apart. And everything was in one pan. Slow cook it. Excellent. Delish. Here you go. Mm. Okay. Did you want to try it? Yeah, I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna take the broken chop. Yeah, of course. We just leveled up. <laughs> leveled up. Mm. Let me take a test. Look at that. They're so tender and they're juicy. Not dry. Delish. Mmm. Oh, the flavor in there is very good. Oh yes, I taste the, I mean the garlic. The Jack Daniels rub. Mmm. It's delicious. I'm glad I put that pork gravy on at the end. I threw it on, let it sit for like five, 10 minutes. Done. Yep. There That's good. Go. Mmm, delicious. Delish. Thanks for joining me. Have a good one. Don't forget to subscribe to Subbo's Kitchen and remember be the best you can be. That's right. And every day. 30% 30 off. 30% off. 30% off. In 30 the link. Starts today, goes through September 30th. Link will be in the description below. Bye. Bye. Let's see.